why is my Outlook grayed out? If you've opened Outlook only to find that several of your toolbar buttons are grayed out and unusable, you're not alone. This issue can be frustrating, especially when you need those features to get your work done. Let's figure out what might be causing this problem. First, it's important to check if the issue is specific to your Outlook profile or if it's a broader problem. Sometimes certain buttons like Read Aloud, Send to OneNote, Share to Teams, Report Fish, Send Documents, and Reply with Meeting Poll can be grayed out due to various reasons. One common reason is that your Office version might be outdated. If you're using an older version of Microsoft 365 apps for Enterprise, it could be the culprit. Try updating your Office version by going to File, Office Account, Update Options, Update Now. This can often resolve issues related to outdated software. Another possibility is that there's an issue with your Outlook profile. You might want to try recreating your Outlook profile or even testing the account on another user's machine to see if the problem persists. This can help determine if the issue is specific to your profile or the machine you're using. If updating and profile checks don't work, it's worth looking into the add-ins and settings within Outlook. Ensure that the necessary add-ins are enabled and that there are no conflicts. For example, if the read aloud function is grayed out, you can try removing and re-adding it via File, Options, Accessibility, Show Read Aloud. Additionally, check if any of the grayed out options require specific permissions or settings to be enabled. For instance, features like Account Privacy need to be turned on via File, Office Account, Account Privacy, Manage Settings. Turn on optional connected experiences to work properly. If none of these steps work, you might need to perform a basic repair of your Office installation. Go to Apps and Features, select your Office version, and choose Modify Repair. This can sometimes fix issues that are causing the buttons to be grayed out. In some cases, the problem could be related to how Outlook is integrated with other applications or services. For example, if you're using Copernic Desktop Search, the Outlook icon might be grayed out if the free trial does not include Outlook indexing or if the Outlook version is not supported. You might need to adjust settings or use a different plugin to resolve this. Lastly, if you're still stuck, it might be helpful to check the registry entries for your Outlook profile. Sometimes, settings in the registry can cause certain options to be grayed out and unchangeable. This would require some technical troubleshooting, like such as checking the registry entries under batch key current user software Microsoft Office Profiles. By following these steps, you should be able to identify and fix the issue with your grayed out Outlook toolbar buttons. Remember to always keep your software updated and check the specific settings and permissions required for each feature to work correctly.